Tonight, it could be a breakthrough in the opioid crisis. Researchers in Stockton have developed a new overdose reversal drug delivery system they believe can save lives. And it comes as thousands of Californians are dying or being hospitalized each year from opioid overdoses, with most cases involving the use of fentanyl. ABC 10's Becca Habegger reports from the lab at University of the Pacific. And I will share, and I will keep it like this. Here in Professor Mamun Al Hamadshe's lab at University of the Pacific's Thomas J. Long School of Pharmacy, researchers have discovered what they believe could be pivotal in the nation's opioid crisis. We believe this is a scientific breakthrough in the field of drug delivery. You've probably heard of Narcan, the life saving nasal spray that can be administered to someone unconscious from an opioid overdose and almost instantly reverse the overdose. The active ingredient in Narcan is called naloxone. We we are repurposing, we are empowering Naloxone. Professor Al Hamadje and his team have developed a new way of delivering Naloxone to the body, an injection that deposits several days worth of Naloxone just under the skin, which sprinkles itself throughout the body over the course of a week. At least a week, I mean, that's the exciting thing we've seen. I mean, if you look at the, the typical uh, Narcan, which is basically the one that you find over the, the counter in some pharmacies, they stay in the body for maximum a couple of hours. Fentanyl and other potent opioids can stay in the body for several hours, he says, outlasting the overdose reversal power of one Narcan dose. He says this long-acting naloxone delivery system called HD5 can be used to reverse an overdose or prevent someone from overdosing. This is crucial for mass casualty situation. For example, he says a U.S. soldier entering hostile territory could take the drug to protect against an opioid-based chemical weapon for an entire week with just one injection. Uh, yeah. The team's discovery, which has only been tested on animals so far, though with promising results, was published last month in the prestigious journal Nature Communications. I'm very proud of the impact that this could have. Hala Alderwood is a postdoctoral research fellow here in Professor al lab and first author of the study. She says the drug delivery system, if eventually FDA approved for humans, as they hope, could help save the lives of teens who accidentally overdose on fentanyl. They take pills that they didn't know it's fentanyl, but sadly it's laced with fentanyl. So they die and they didn't know they are taking fentanyl. Public health officials say illicit drug dealers are adding fentanyl into pills and products that don't normally contain opioids to make them more addictive. As for the future, the team hopes this long acting drug delivery system could be used for other drugs as well, including insulin for diabetes patients, cancer drugs and more. In Stockton, Becca Habiger, ABC 10. And the professor tells us the work has been funded with a $2 million grant from the National Institutes of Health. We asked if the team is worried that the money could dry up given the Trump's administration's attempts to freeze and cut federal funding. The professor tells us that because their work is targeting the opioid crisis, something President Trump has cited as a major concern, he is confident their funding will continue and hopefully grow.